Hi there, this is a new session. I have a guest. It's Emil. Hi, Emil. Yeah. Um, you're from Rewind, Refined Wiki, I'm sorry. Yes. Um, and we want to know everything that is new that you've built. We are in Atlas Camp in Barcelona. And actually, there is something that you can uh, show. So, what is it? Yeah. So, we uh, recently released the Refined Theme 5.0, mm -hmm. which is our... Um, fifth edition. Fifth edition. It's uh, We've been... Uh, on the market now for six or seven years, so uh, so it's uh, this is this is a big step for us. The, the um, sort of a new generation of theming that mm -hmm. we're rolling out. So I can give you some um, some um, uh, introduction to what we have released. So um, what are you showing? Is still for uh, Confluence Server? This or is, is it, yeah. yeah. So this is uh, still for Confluence Server, uh, and uh, I will uh, yeah I will. Talk a little bit about the cloud thing later. Sorry. Okay, yeah. cool. So um, one thing that we introduce in, in the 5.0 version is that you can add modules to your category navigation. So for example, if you have a HR category, you can add uh, like questions and uh, have blog posts. Mm -hmm. So you can customize the the navigation more richly. It's not only like spaces. It's uh, you can add links um, and. Uh, yeah, and questions, and uh, mm -hmm. even your own modules. So, uh, so if you have like want to show a Twitter feed or whatever, you can mm -hmm. do it in the category menu. Oh, okay. Um, so it's a small landing page that appears within my menu, kind of. Sort of. Configurable. Sort of. Sort yeah. Of. Okay. That, that, that. Uh, and um, the new theming part is the, the big thing that we released in Five Zero, mm -hmm. and I can give you a, a quick demo how it works. Uh, so let's get out of this. Uh, here we go. So it's sort of a, like a theming editor. So basically anyone can apply the company branding. So yeah, cool. you, you pick a, a background template, so it could be a, like, a, like a full version like this or a partial like this. Mm -hmm. And then you decide if you want to have like one row header, uh, you can have two row header, uh, and you can add... Um, like uh, different uh, well, navigation like, menus, so it's yeah. it's sort of like a, a Photoshop light for yeah. theming, and this is so. Uh, I, I, um, I think WordPress.com has a similar experience where you can just yeah. like um, what you see and what you get yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. Uh, go through certain steps. And so, um, what I understand from seeing this is um, you try to help me as a customer to uh, get my branding right yeah. without having to code too much? Yes. Yeah, okay. You don't need to code anything and and the goal with this is that this is a good um, like it's a good way to do theming because it's uh, it will be safe for upgrades uh, mm -hmm. for Confluence. We will take care of of all the rendering stuff. So um, we still have an an advanced mode which I'm going to demo as well. It's uh, but this we, we want more like this is <laughs> like uh, the easiest way to do it, mm -hmm. and it will be like the cheapest way to do it for for um, for our customers as well. Yeah, uh, and um, yeah, so I, I think it's a, it's a, it's it's a great uh, option if you have like a, you want some add like branding to Confluence. Mm -hmm. You don't want to change ev everything, uh, and you can do it in like minutes. So uh, yeah. Yes. So I see there's a space. Overview and then the dashboard. Yeah, yeah so this is uh, actually preview. So you can see how will this theme look in the dashboard. So yeah. and with the category menu, it will look like this. And uh, with a pop-up window, it will look like this. So, oh, okay. so this is like different previews. Yeah. yeah. And I see, saw beforehand that you have like different styles or themes that I can work uh, yeah, with. Yeah, so like a yeah. mountain theme. And, yeah, 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 uh, yeah. I will show you. But we, we actually have released a site called themes.refinewiki.com, okay. which is uh, sort of like a, a theme share portal where, where you can download themes. Mm -hmm. So if you're using Refine Theme, you can download free the themes from there. And uh, so uh, you can start from one of those, uh, tweak it, or so. I, I can show you. Okay, awesome. And, Uh, okay, so um, let's open up this again. Yeah, so we we still have a, an advanced mode. Okay. And now with uh, with the five point zero version, you can actually code with IntelliJ or Eclipse your own environment. So oh, okay. we have a, a a little script, so you can deploy your theme like in uh, I think it's about zero point five seconds. Mm -hmm. So you can uh, develop like 
code advanced themes in a more professional way now with um, uh, Refine Theme 5.0. How, so how did, does that differ from uh, what Confluence offers me natively? Um, is that kind of the same or...? Um, so uh, you, you st you're still using our like um, organization tools so you can create your menus. So this is just theming like, um, like developing themes that change the, the look and feel of your Refine Wiki instance. Yeah. Okay. So it's um, so it's uh, it's still like uh, you're doing a refined wiki theme. Mm -hmm. uh, so you you don't need to do everything. It's just yeah. like the styling part. But uh, I have some more options than in the menus. Yeah, uh, exactly. So this is a more. So we what we want is that professional people that actually are coders and 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 know like um, like front end developers. They can use this. Uh, this service and that one themes, but yeah. but we want people that uh, is that new or have they done that in the past? As, uh, yeah, so already? so we have we have um, you can do it in the previous version of Refine Theme as well, but then you're doing it in the online code editor, so you need to code it sort of in your web browser. So mm -hmm. it's a bit um, it's a bit tricky to to get it get it right, but in this version, then now you can code it in your own editor and where you are comfortable and where you know how to do it so and you can also then like um, have your code in uh, in uh, in bitbucket or or wherever you want and you, oh, okay. and you awesome. can use uh, like for css you can use use sas or whatever you want to use how do i get um, my hands on on this is that live already do i um like is 5.0 is that on the marketplace already? yeah yeah and, so we released yeah. it in uh, in mars uh, and uh, we uh, yeah, so it's it, it's out there, and okay. uh, and we have a couple of like uh, like uh, on Bitbucket some demo th uh, themes that you can actually download if you want to see how it works with the advanced theming. So okay. that's that's. Um, Where should I go if I if I try that? Like, so, so, so our documentation. Uh, so uh, it's refinedwiki.com. It's uh, yeah, it's docs.refinedwiki.com. Okay, awesome. Yeah, and then you find. Yeah. Okay. Cool. So um, we also um, uh, have released a new. Uh, blog experience with Confluence, so you can mm -hmm. actually create a blog site, and you can have blogs in your categories as well. Uh, so, what we basically have done is that uh, now we can create a space or a blog. Mm -hmm. A blog doesn't need to live only in the space. It's like um, we have uh, separated them. Ah, uh, we have we have to. Um, yeah, we have to speed uh, up. Move fast. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. So this is the site I was talking about, where we actually uh, share like uh, like themes that can be made with yeah, the okay. mm -hmm. theme five point zero version and uh, the so theme marketplace, yeah, refined so wiki no, theme marketplace. But it's free. So yeah. what, what we want people to do is that they should explore and try and get things inspired. Uh, that, that's from you right now, the themes or yeah. Do so you have, uh, yeah. third party people um, could I, could I offer a theme here? Uh, you will in uh, in uh, in upcoming versions yeah, of okay. the site. So, so right now, I would send you an email and say, "Look, I, I really want my theme yeah, to be there." Yeah, and and the <laughs> so so what we've done. But it's is not for pay, right? No, so uh, because but, uh, but you need you, WordPress. They're like free themes and for pay themes. But yeah. you, you offer you yeah. offer like free themes. Yeah, here they are they are free. But I, I should say that you need to purchase Refine Theme, our theming add-on. Yeah, uh, I, I was taking that for granted. Yeah, yeah. of course, <laughs> of course. Yeah, yeah, okay. But if you have a add on they are free, so you can yeah, use okay. them. Cool. So we, we developed this site because we wanted to show how easy it is to create uh, different types of themes. Yeah. So we will release um, uh, more themes as we go. So actually here in, in Barcelona, we will release uh, a Barcelona theme tomorrow. Oh, awesome. It's going to come out here. Cool. So, so can, I, um, can I ask you some nasty questions? Yes. Um, there are other... Um, theming vendors out there. Yep. What's what's the difference? Why, why should I go with Refined Wiki? What's your yeah. special strengths, your superpowers that uh, should make customers go with your yeah. solution? So I think uh, one big difference between us and our our um, competitors is that we are just a theming company. We do add-ons. That's the only thing we do. We don't yeah. do any services. Yeah. So we develop a product where, where anyone can get started. And, yeah. and it should be simple. You don't need to have like uh, tons of consultancy working yeah. on the, with the implementation. So that has been um, a focus for us from the beginning to to make it simple. Um, it's also cheap uh, this way, right? Because I, I just buy the yeah. license and yeah. I'm done, yeah. right? And we are actually cheaper as well, like for add-on pricing uh, yeah. than our com competitors. 
And um, let, let me share that for for those people who uh, are really interested in getting a, the full picture. I think um, uh, Brickit is yeah. a um, provider of themes. I think they're um, at the same level as Confluence. So if I paid 20k for Confluence, you'll have to pay uh, 20k for. Um, uh, I, I think uh, they're a, a bit a bit less than. Oh, okay, than, than, then uh, they probably yeah. reduce that. Yeah. Um, but it's you know like yeah. um, uh, can be hefty. Yeah. Um, and. Um, there are vendors like us who do theming like from scratch, yeah. and this is, uh, as you said, like uh, a lot of work. Yeah. Uh, not not cheap, not fast, not uh, upgrade safe as uh, something like this. And then there's adaptive scene builder. Actually, I don't know how strong this is in the market. Do you see it a lot still? Um, no, not really. Yeah, I, I, I'm not sure if. Uh, do they do they develop that for current version still? Uh, yeah, I you think, should know. I think so. They they have, but but uh, you you can of course see at marketplace and see how it's going for for other uh, yeah. add-ons and. And I, I saw you do some uh, nice stats about around uh, other um, uh, plugins once. Did, didn't you have? Didn't you quote some some statistics about um, how add-ons went, like downloads and all this stuff? Um, I, thought, I think that was yeah, you. maybe, maybe. Yeah. It's a, a it couple of years ago. Yeah, it's a couple of years ago. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course, we are, we are keeping track of our yeah, okay. competitors. So. so, what else do we have? Um, there is Comunado has uh, Qt. They call. Yeah, I, yeah. I never meet, meet this either. So yeah, so we, we, yeah. I, I think that we have a. a but you're kind of like the leading yeah, thing. Yeah, like we, whenever a customer comes to us and says, "Look, I want to have this quick and easy and not so expensive," yeah. we always send that's, them that's your great. way. Yeah. That's great. So um, we we are leading uh, at the moment, and um, we, we have invested a lot in our new generation of theming, which yeah. will be rolling out this year. So, And you also have a cloud offering uh, coming up as yeah, so, far as the lesson allows that. <laughs> yeah, so we are, we are working on it. It's still experimental, So, uh, mm -hmm. but uh, there will be something going out, so it's, it's too, too soon to show anything um, like... Um, we have a prototype, but, but uh, that's... that's okay. We, uh, Is there a last thing that you wanted to show? There's something that... Um, or... Otherwise, I would ask, um, how can I get in contact? So I've seen this video now, and I think, oh, that's that's interesting what Emil um, showed. Do you actually want to get in contact with people, or do they do you want to have them go to the marketplace and directly buy and so, submit uh, yeah, questions? Yeah, that's a good question. So uh, we, uh, of course, if people contact us, we we are glad to answer because um, we we don't uh, like. Uh, come out to uh, companies and and, mm -hmm. uh, and and sell that way. It's, it's um, so. How do I contact you? So Is it an email or yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, hand? yeah. So you can do uh, refundwiki at Twitter or info at uh, refundwiki.com or through support at Okay, awesome. So it's uh, yeah, cool. So Emil, um, I think your yeah, I uh, computer <laughs> told us that we're way over time yeah, now. Yeah. Um, uh, thanks for sharing this yeah. new stuff. I'm very happy. Um, to to got an update. Yeah. Thanks. Thanks. Bye.